What is up, everybody? It is Dante of A Fresh Culture back at y'all again with another shoe review. Today, as you see in the description, we are reviewing the Air Jordan 11 Low Legend Blue. But before we get into that, I need you to do the usual for me. Hit that thumbs up, you know, that like button. Hit the subscribe button and the notification bell, but set that notification bell to all so you can be notified on all videos being dropped as well as when I go live. Speaking of going live, this is Kick Squad TV. So when I go live, all the Kick Squad goes live. Same thing for the rest of the crew. So in the description below are the links to everybody in the squad. Click on theirs, subscribe to their channels, hit the notification bell, set those to all as well. Because like I said, when one of us goes live, all of us goes live. So I appreciate that, y'all. Also, in effect, are still $12 tees on thefreshculture.com. We are dropping new stuff. I got new things dropping throughout the month before the end of May is over. Did I say that right? Before the month of May is over, <laughs> there will be new stuff dropping. Same thing going into June. So y'all want to be on the lookout for that. Sign up for the newsletter. Be in the know and follow on Instagram as well. You see it down there. This is one of those spots there. Website and Instagram is down there. So y'all go ahead and do that for me, man. So without further ado, <laughs> without further ado, let's get into the shoe. Ooh, unlimited bars. What? What? Anyway. <laughs> Without further ado, let's get into the shoe, the Air Jordan 11 Low Legend Blue. That was more bars. What? Bam, there you have it. The Air Jordan 11 box there. You got, you know, Air Jordan, you know, it's Air Jordan, right? With the Carolina Blue Jump Man right there on the top. Of course, you got your usual jargon, blah, 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 Nike this, Nike that, Portland, Oregon, etc. There's your tag there. It is 11 and a half, which is not my size, which means that this is going out the door when this video is over. So there that is, right? So that is the box. As you can see on the inside, you got your QR code, black paper, etc. You know, I don't get into the box like that unless it's a real special box, right? And this is just your classic, you know, Jordan 11 box there, right? So there is the box and now the shoe. So if you guys remember this shoe, Jordan wore the high top version of this in the All-Star game back in 1996. He broke these things out, all white, patent leather, Carolina blue, but it was the high top. I'm not a fan of lows, of, of the 11 lows, so which is why I really didn't go for this shoe for myself, but the high top, man, if they ever release that one again, it's lint here. If they ever release that one ever again, I'm going for it because I really want that shoe. Never had it. I had the all black patent leather, but that's the only color patent leather Jordan that I had. As you can see here, your Jordan 11 low. You got your all white patent leather, just shiny, crispy, gleaming right there in the light, just beaming, right? Just beaming off the light, your patent leather. On the back side, you got your Jumpman and Carolina Blue. Right here on the upper heel, you got your 23 right there on the back, which is on the original shoe, just of course it's higher. Got your 23 right there. On normal Jordan 11s, uh, the high tops, this is like a, a meshy kind of material. On here, it's leather. So you got your leather material here as well going around the back side. So you got your patent leather going up to the leather but then you have that mesh going up the tongue 
in white, which is very shiny as well. Looks really nice there. And then on the tongue, you have your Jordan Jumpman spelled out right there in awkward, you know, direction letters. And you have your, your Jumpman logo right there in the middle. Uh, the laces, of course, only comes with one color laces, your rope white laces. I do recommend that you double tie these. These rope laces do come unlaced fairly easily. So I suggest that you guys double knot these when you tie them up. On your bottom side, of course, you've got that icy blue there on the bottom going all around the, uh, the sole of the shoe. Got your black on the heel and the toe area. You got your carbon fiber right there in the Carolina in the black checker right there on the side, which is underneath the shoe as well. If you look underneath that ice, you'll see that carbon fiber under there, which gives that extra support for the shoe, right? And of course, on your midsole, you got your white, your plain white midsole with that ice coming through, going up the midsole as well. And if you look at the inside, you got your black jump man, and it has 25 right there, which is the anniversary of the shoe. So you have the 25 right there instead of it saying 23 like it does here on the back it has a 25 right there on the inside um overall it is a really dope shoe i'm not really mad that i don't have it that it's not mine but it is a dope shoe and i don't know it, it holding it in my hand kind of makes me feel like ah man I wouldn't have been a bad idea to have a shoe, right? But overall, it is a really dope shoe. Whoever's gonna get their hands on this, it is 11 and a half. It is on my website at freshculture.com. And I do have a size four as well coming in. It's on the way and that is on my website as well. So if you are interested in the shoe, it is there currently at the time of filming this video. 11 and a half and a grade school four. Overall, super dope shoe. I really like it a lot. Um, like I said, I didn't go for it. it. It just the low patent leather wasn't, the low, the low 11 really wasn't my thing. I'd rather have the high top. So, but yeah, man, there you have it. Really nice. Give you one more 360 there. Really nice. It is going for a decent amount of money on gold and stock X and so on around the, uh 250 ish range um and it gets a little bit higher as the sizes get lower so be on the lookout for that they might end up going up a little bit maybe after the weekend possibly but you know we'll see what happens lace ideas you can end up going with black or you can go at a carolina blue i don't think you can go wrong with either one but the white does work well as well because it's really clean and it would just work no matter what. They put it in the shoe for a reason. But black or Carolina blue would go really well with this. Also on top of that, if you have seen my a fresh t-shirts like I have on right now, I have a light blue one. While it does not match the Carolina blue here, it does go well with the ice bottom here on the side. It does go very well. If you see this shoe on my website, uh, you'll see that I paired the shoe with this. Not a really great picture, I just kind of did it. But I did pair it up so you can see that it does match that ice bottom there, but it's 12 bucks. So if you own this shoe, that might be a good look for you. More bars, more bars. Man, I have to go write a song after this. But anyway, <laughs> I appreciate y'all checking for the video, watching it real quick and uh, my little quick, you know, view of this shoe view of this shoe what am i doing with my life right now anyway <laughs> like <laughs> y'all checking out this shoe and uh my little quick review on it my uh what i think of it i think it's a really dope shoe so i appreciate y'all man uh, i'm a little beside myself right now i keep dropping bars left and right i don't know what's wrong with me this morning but it is mother's day tomorrow today is saturday the 8th, tomorrow is the 9th of May, which is Mother's Day. So I wanna give a shout out to all the moms out there. You are important to the world, not just to your own household, but to the entire world. So no matter what anybody does for you on Mother's Day, make sure you do something nice for yourself because you deserve to do something nice for you. Whether it's taking a little bit longer of a nap, whatever you wanna run through the house singing songs, whatever it is, do something that's gonna make your heart skip a beat. For yourself because only we can make ourselves happy the most but of course your kids and so on should be doing something nice for you too that's not excluding them at all so <laughs> happy mother's day to y'all i appreciate everybody watching the video me dropping these bars on just 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 i don't know it was it was it was uh 
Un it was effortless, effortless bars. Before I go, like I said, I need y'all to go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and the notification bell. Set that to all. Do the same thing for everybody in my kick squad below. It helps all of our channels grow. There's our bar again. Below, grow, what you know. I don't know. I'm going to go write a song later on, like I said. I'm going to have to go write a song. So until next time, much love. God bless. Stay fresh.